Hey there, third graders. Thanks for joining me again. And of course, good to see you. Yesterday, you compare and contrasted the main ideas and supporting details of the pro and con articles. Today, you're gonna to be able to show what you've learned so far this week by taking a short quiz. Remember our guiding questions. Why are the world's freshwater sources threatened? And how do people persuade others to take action to contribute to a better world? Take a moment and think about the second question and the article we've been reading this week. All right, let's make sure you have everything you need for today. First, make sure you have a copy of our text, Pro Con Should We Stop Recycling Our Trash? And just a reminder, it's on page 75 of your ELA packet. You're also gonna need a copy of Lesson 28 and the Lesson 28 quiz on pages 84 and 85 of your ELA packet. And of course, you'll need that pencil. Pause the video here and make sure you have all the materials you need for today's lesson. The learning target for this lesson is I can use a text to answer questions. Today you'll take the article we've been reading all week, pro con, should we stop recycling our trash, and take a short quiz to show what you've learned. But first, it's time to read with your family member, caregiver, or friend. If you'd like to hear the text read aloud, you can go back to the video from Lesson 25. Go ahead and pause here and complete your reading. You've done a lot of work already this week. Remember the work that you've done so far. You found the main idea and supporting details of the pro article. You found the main idea and supporting details of the con article. And you compare and contrast the main ideas and supporting details of the two articles. With your family member, caregiver, or friend, talk about the following questions. Use the text and your note catchers from earlier in this week to support you. Pause after each question to discuss. First question is, what is the main idea and supporting details of the pro article? Go ahead and pause here and discuss. All right, the second question is, what is the main idea and supporting details of the con article? Go ahead and pause the video here and talk. And hope you're ready for it. The third and final question is, what are the similarities and differences of the main ideas and supporting details of the two articles? Pause the video here and have your final part of the discussion. All right, now that you've read, thought, and talked about the text, it's time to show off what you've learned so far this week. Go ahead and turn to the Lesson 28 quiz on page 70 of your ELA packet. Actually, I believe that's page 85 of your ELA packet. Use the text pro con, should we stop recycling our trash, to answer each of the questions on the quiz. Remember to look back in the text when you need to. All right, go ahead and pause here and take that quiz. All right, nice job showing off what you learned so far this week. It's time again to wrap up the lesson. Go ahead and share your answers with someone and tell them why you chose the ones that you did. Go ahead and show them where in the text you have your evidence. Also, please remember to spend 20 minutes reading with a family member, caregiver, or friend. And one last thing, before we finish up, I want you to work on your fluency practice. Use a timer and read the passage for one minute. Count the words you read and write that number at the top of your text next to that number that you did at the beginning of the week. Look at how many more words you read in one minute. Go ahead and celebrate your reading fluency with someone. I'm proud of you. All right, that's it for today. Thanks for joining in and learning with me again. And I'll see you tomorrow for our last lesson of the week. We'll be working on a writing activity where you'll get to share your point of view. All right, until then, bye.